When the cage door locks, basically it's just kind of sense of like, here we go. Um, now I'm able to focus, kind of tune everything out, and uh, it's just time to dial in, um, think about my game plan. I find my confidence in everything, you know, that I've done through camp, you know, the workouts that Tiffany at uh, Blunt Force Trainings put me through, you know, my coaches at the gym. Um, I, I just know that, you know, it's time to go and, you know, it's ready to happen. It's pretty much unexplainable. You can't really, can't really explain what goes on. Maybe I haven't had enough fights yet to be able to uh, break things down, but it's, it's such a crazy feeling to just uh, go in there and have all the fans be cheering you on. And then the second you hear the cage shut, it's, you know it's on and there's no way out. So whenever the fight's over, it's, uh, it's such a rush and uh, gives you a huge adrenaline shot that it's hard to explain. How I, how I got started in MMA is uh, basically, you know, I was just looking uh, for kind of an outlet for some aggression. Um, you know, I kind of have a boxing background a little bit, um, and it was just kind of a release for me at first. And, uh, you know, I had a, a good friend, co-worker, uh, PJ Riley, who was uh, one of the top kickboxers in the state, um, take me to the gym, and we kind of started playing around. and. You know, within a month, two months, three months, it just started building so quick that it was getting to the point where it was like, um, ready to compete. And, um, you know, I got hooked up with Ground Zero and, you know, just the progress grew so quick that it just kind of naturally happened to uh, taking a fight and going from there. My martial arts experience has been pretty much, uh, I wrestled all through high school um, since first grade pretty much. I uh, joined the Marines and I did uh, Jiu Jitsu and a little bit of Muay Thai and some boxing but it wasn't really geared towards cage fighting or MMA, it was just more groundwork and uh, you know like having classes that wasn't specifically for MMA, that wasn't my goal, I was just you know going to, to train something and uh, I, started, I started training here in November 2011. and. Um, and that's pretty much it. What I know about my opponent Josh is he, he uh, spent some time in the Marines. Um, you know, obviously they're known for being mentally tough. You know, my game plan for uh, you know beating them is you know fighting my fight. Um, you know, like I said before, strong, strong striking, um, and you know I got I got a lot of will as well. And you know, I I know for a fact that I'm not going to give up. I plan on coming out and breaking his will. You know, the, uh, the title fight between myself and Justin Moss, it's, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go wherever he wants to go. And uh, I think that uh, I'm, a, I'm a better fighter than he is. And uh, he thinks because I, I went three rounds in my last fight that I'm not a decent fighter. And I've been hearing he's been talking trash. And I'm out there to prove him wrong. And I'm out there to smash his face. And